Alright, here we go. Another day for riding. I'm going to do the running, running mount, stepping mount. Easy peasy, eh? Uh, weather's great. I'm great. And my bike, guess what? It's super great, right? Yeah, <coughs> just chuck my gloves on. We're off on 500k ride today. 500. Um, out through some of Victoria's great roads. I got me. I got me air suit on today. I don't know if you can see it in the mirror. Airflow. Oh, it feels good. I can because it's going to be 29 today. So, got the airflow suit. It feels good already. Nice and airy. Oh, it really works. It's actually the first time I'm wearing the airflow suit on the bike. And um, oh, look at that. Oh, especially when I stand up. Whoa. When I stand up. Bloody hell, I should, wear this. I should wear this on some of those safaris. Feels good. And the, you know, the material on this is like, uh, it's rough, hard wearing. Um, if you know the rally suit, the rally suit's kind of woolly. And it's got a soft texture to it. Um, and you might worry about the rally suit on things like hard branches and stuff like that. But this one, this airflow, I tell ya, like if you're doing, I mean if you're doing touring where you go from cold to hot, fair enough, stick to the uh, rally suit, because that'll keep you warm and cool. But if you if you know you're going to go to a rally that's just going to be hot, like uh, like if you did the Cape York rally, or you know you're going to do something like the Cape York rally, um, I would be using, I reckon, now that I've tried it, the, this airflow suit. On. It feels really good. Like the air is really flowing through it. And even when I sit down, it's definitely going right up my arms. Um, right through my arms, like all the way. And my legs, it's going over the top of my legs really nicely. Wow, I think I'm going to have a cool day, literally. It's going to be 29, but I think I'm going to be... I'm going to be pretty cool in this. Whoa. Gee, get a load of that. There's the um, Maribyrnong River, I think it is. Yep. Oh, get a feel of that, eh? Oh, that's nice. 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 Mm, 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 mm. BMW Airflow suit. Whoa, yeah, baby. <laughs> yeah, it's a good one. I think I like it a lot. So, let's see, it's um, 16 degrees and I've got air flowing through me so it's a bit cool. But see, it's 16 degrees, it's nice because you know the, you know it's going to be a hot day and, um, and it's that kind of 16 degrees, it's not 16 winter, it's 16 summer degrees, you know. So, feels good. Let's see if I can get a glimpse of myself in the mirror, eh? Mm. Nah, no good mirrors there. No good mirrors here? Nah. There you go. Oh, it feels lovely. Did I tell you it feels lovely? Freaking awesome. Mm. Alright, well I'm off. I'll keep you posted with some more... Uh, oh, my camera's a bit crooked. Some more uh, ride data as we go, but um, yeah, this suit. Phew, I'll let you know how it goes through the day, but I like it. It's a plain looking, you know. It's a very subtle looking suit. It's just 
black with some wiry mesh on it you know see that see that see this sort of gray bit that's like a, a wiry mesh that air just flows through it completely utterly bloody awesome well <laughs> forever going a hot rally again this one's in I reckon it is really good Whew. and nothing's clingy about it the way they've engineered the inside um, like you know the back bit the back bit uh, doesn't cling stick to your back they've sort of ribbed where, where the um, the back protection sits it doesn't sit flat on your back and it's kind of ribbed so air flows through you between your back and the um, air flows through between your back and the guard so nothing's sticking to your back flat so you get airflow around the back it's freaking you know that's a strawman yeah that's good that's air engineering yeah mmm bam top of door there you go so have a think of that Whoa. later mate